We will create a simple PowerPoint presentation for our final project, and I have a, an example of that on the screen here now. Quick review of this, I'll go to the slideshow button at the bottom and run through these slides. Here's a title and then the design problem, some research and, and investigation. There's the existing site with an image brought in, which we'll learn how to do later. The design solution, which includes a, another imported image. The challenges, recommendations for the future, and then a uh, final slide for questions. I'll begin this by opening up uh, a PowerPoint file, a new one that is, and for the title I can I can type in the title here and I can enter some other information down here. Uh, for the next slide, if I go to the new slide button at the top here, I can enter uh, design design problem and then I can create some text here. And these are my design problems. I can enter another new slide. This will be uh, my research and investigations. And some more information here. Another new slide. And this will be my this will be my design problem. And I can put some information in there. I'll head an, uh, another new slide, and this one will be my design solution. I'm purposely not adding any images at this point, because I'm going to do that at another time. <clears throat> and then uh, another new slide for my design challenges. And I can write about those. I'll enter another new slide for my recommendations for the future. And it's up to you the content. This is some suggested content that that you could use. You're certainly welcome to customize it however you'd like. Um, and then a, a concluding slide, which might be different, and you can change the layout of a slide. There's a number of options here, including uh, comparisons and two content and others. I'm going to put in a section header here. And I'll call this, um, I'll put questions here. And maybe I'll say thank you. So however you want to conclude your slide. Now, um, we have some things typed in. We want to look at the design of this slide. And uh, fortunately, PowerPoint makes this easy. If you go to the Design tab here, you can select some predetermined designs, which have the font and the colors 
and the formatting already laid out. And if I just rest my pointer on each of these, you can see how they look, depending on what you're looking for and the style of your project, your personal style, your company style, etc. You can select one of these pre-formatted designs and then you can also go in and and change those as needed. So that's my uh, my PowerPoint. I can review it in my presentation mode and see how it looks. Looks pretty good. What we'll do next is to import some images from AutoCAD into PowerPoint.